Well, not much was known about ALS until just a few years ago when the ice bucket challenge swept over social media. In this week's Doing Good report, we show you how the Arkansas chapter of the ALS Association is working to increase that awareness as an effort to find a cure. first walk was 2006. ALS Association Arkansas Chapter co-founders Betty Julian and Shannon Holly started the annual walk to defeat ALS in Northwest Arkansas because of a request by their friend Sue Larson, who was battling the progressive neurodegenerative disease at the time. It was the first ALS walk in the entire state. We put the first walk together in six weeks and thought we would only have one walk. And here we are 13 years later, and now we cover the entire state of Arkansas. Though the walk, which was the first in Arkansas, has grown over the years, Years, the need for it was apparent almost immediately. And when we noticed that there were many, many others, and just in Northwest Arkansas, that needed our help, that's when we decided that we needed to continue this legacy for Sue. Sadly, Sue lost her battle with ALS some years ago, but ALS Association Executive Director Jennifer Necessary says the dedication of Sue's friends moves her to this day because of one thing. Commitment. Their commitment to a friend and how they have carried that out for all of these years uh, truly touches my heart. The ALS Association covers all the bases for patients and their families, from research to patient and community services to public education and advocacy. Oh, I think Sue is looking down from heaven and just, I cannot believe that y'all now cover the entire state of Arkansas just from one little request to bring awareness, but she'd be very happy. That was Nate Custer reporting. The ALS Association will hold its second annual gala event this Saturday, and the walk to defeat ALS is Saturday, August 25th. Last year's walk raised more than $350,000, and the association hopes to go beyond that this year. Go to nwahomepage.com to sign up for the walk or gala, and you can also learn more about the organization and how they work locally to serve those battling the disease.